we are in a derelict factory. Apologies, the last episode there was an export issue, so the episode actually ended without getting to the actual conclusion. So this episode is going to be a little bit longer. Why don't we start where we left off? I think we have all the materials, so... I think we move, use this to grab the teleporter again. And then we can, because we have all the materials. We have the kyber, the kyber crystal, sorry, kyber ore. Yeah. So we can just do, and the power unit, there we go. Processing. Kyber mesh battery completed. Sending to elevator room. Please use laser crane for safe handling. Perfect! Where's Robo when you need him, you know? This is so dope. So now we can use this to grab the battery we just made. Plop that baby right in here. So, dude. Elevator online. Yeah, it is. I think we got it. I mean, let's go. The elevator. Yeah, let's exit the factory. This is so, I, oh my, I'm blown away. I am blown the flip. Oh, we're back on the world map. All right, so that's where, that's where Sarai, that's Sarai's home. This is the Cerulean Expanse, which looks like where the Dakari would have been. But of course, Cerulean Reservoir, we need to catch some fish. This is so dope. Like, being in a different world. They even have, like, the trash cans with... Reminds me a little bit of um, Star Ocean 2. Or Star Ocean 1, I should say. Oh, there is an item here. So we need to jump into the water first. How many new fish can we actually find here? Oh, four new fish. That makes sense. It's a completely different world. Swim up here, and we can grab a chest, which contains a data strip. I don't know what the data strip does, but... Wait, so if there's four fish, are these the last four we need? Y'all, I think we're about to get the last four fish in the entire game. And the first one we get is... A silicium sponge. Okay, gross. And... A cybernardal her, her, uh, hermit crab. And a laser burbot. I love this. This is so funny. All right, we got one more. And there it is. Our last fish in the entire game, a coil flounder. We get the trophy master angler. Catch every fish species at least once. There you go, friends. We have caught them all. They are all ours. We've done it. God, this game is good. What was the item that we got, though? A data strip. With enough strips, a cipher could be created. Huh. Can't believe we got all the fish. It's back on the world map. Let's actually see if there's anything at camp. Well, there wasn't anything, so let's go to Rapine. Rapine. Replicant. Oh, it's like they already... Oh, they just, like, kick you off with... Oh, man. Okay, there's like sand dunes. So, so the Dakari, I wonder if, is there anything over here? Like what are the skulls? Like what are these supposed to be? We never saw anything that looked like that, right? Like what about the sleeper of this world? And I don't know how, I don't know how like parallel, I don't, oh. This is so Star Ocean 1. Chrono Trigger. 
My house is all the way up. We can make our plans there. Dude, Sarai, you're so cool. Save point. There's no peace left in our hearts. Yeah, I believe you. Oh, I saw something. Oh, okay. A little ore, maybe? You know, I was going to say, we haven't really... I feel like... There's something over here. Another rainbow conch in this little alleyway here. A little... Doesn't look like a big area, but a lot of little nooks and crannies there. How many does that bring us to? 52. Rainbow Canches. Oh, it's another inn. Of course they're here. Do you need to rest? Uh, no. Can I actually... Can I go in here? See, now I feel like we need to rest because I don't know. Find me something sweet. Oh, uh, Peach Strudel. Tasty. Feed me something warming. What the hell is warm? What do you want? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, warming? Let's give him. A, let's give him a a, a bula base. Tasty. Feed me something meaty. Uh, what was a cruce? What was that? Can I, can I, can I, is there like a place where I can, I guess if I rest, I can. I wish there was some way to cheer people up. It's like I'm the only one other than Sarai who still has some energy, but I'm no fighter. You're from another world, right? You got any games out there? Wheels, huh? That does sound like it could be fun. Yeah, will you play wheels with me? Could you do me a favor and ask that watchmaker from your world if there's any way to get a table delivered here? I'd love to play some wheels. Uh, sure? All right, let's see if we can, yes. It's also free. Doesn't look like we need to pay anything. What a weird world. All right, let's cook. Um, want something meaty? Let me make a, what's like the cheapest things? A sandwich? All right, let's just make a couple things. Maybe a salad. Tomato club. Berry jam. I need to make sashimi, though, for sure. All right, let's see. What do you want? Something meaty. All right, we'll give you a roast sandwich. Something light. Uh, oh, well, I made a salad. Basic salad. Tasty. Something from the water. Okay, so that's anything with fish so we'll make we'll give him that nice and this was everything i ever wanted and more dispensing reward another that's 53 let's go all right cool i don't see anything else in here so let's uh let's skadoodles um hello someone must have known Oh, there's another chest up here. Another data strip. Okay, so we have two of those now. Someone must have known. What does that mean? Known that this would happen? Maybe something over here. Oh, there's a person. Sarai, why would you return? Oh, found tomatoes. This is so cool. In case I haven't said that enough. Dear viewer, they did too much to us. It looks like that's maybe a shop. Get it out of my head. They're all like robots, but... Oh, there's like robot kids? I want a way back to my mind. What does that mean? I still see it in my dreams. They're being tortured. I wish that I could give up. Right, but they literally can't. Because they're feeding this... What was it? The dweller of, uh... What dweller did they say? All right, well, maybe we can check this one out. Oh, a rainbow conch. Cool. For free? We just sitting there? Merchant has a... Adamantine staff. A kyber steel blade. A seemingly sentient material that becomes soft as cloth when protection isn't needed. 
an implant for Sarai that removes one star from allies entering KO state. Oh, that's a, that seems like a good one, but wait, eight gold, that's it? Are you kidding, are you kidding me? Sealed using powerful encryption. A cipher might do the trick. Ah, well we have two data strips, so maybe we can maybe we can get more. Maybe we can go this way now into this. Hello. Is this like a bank? Oh, no, they sell a recipe for yakatori shrimp. Yeah, we'll definitely buy that. Need uh, need uh, we need to cook everything for trophies and whatnot. So I used to feel same. I don't want to stay. How can I go on? We should have turned the other way. What do you? Oh, because they try. Did they try to fight back? Is that is that the idea? They tried to fight back against the Fleshmancer. And no Solstice children can be born in their world, so that's why Sarai came to us. Let's see if we can... I'm like, I don't know if I want to buy weapons just yet for our friends. But that might be pretty good. I think I, I just need to sell some stuff here. I guess I could sell all of... all of Garl's... There's no way he's dead, like, dead forever. I just, I don't believe it. All right, I actually don't think I'm gonna be able to buy. It's kind of expensive. So let's continue on a little bit and see what money we encounter. So let's go to Sarai's house. Good morning, Cedric. Good morning, Sarai. I see your journey to other worlds in search of Solstice Warriors has proven successful. Odds increase drastic. What's the status? Moon still sunken. Sun remains blocked by clouds. Fleshmancer yet inhabits the castle which cannot be reached. Active threat, Dweller of Dread. Ah, didn't we defeat... Interesting. Any recent events? Fleshmancer activity detected a few days ago. Fleshmancer left briefly for another world, returned with new monster lieutenant named Ellison Durrell. Berlina. Confrontation with Ellison Durrell not recommended. We'll see about that. Recommended action. Use Solstice Warriors to defeat Dweller of Dread. Recommended action dependency. Make for sky base to remove clouds and reconnect sun and moon. Hmm. How to get there? Report. Surveil of the Cerulean Expanse continued while you were away. And? Faint energy was detected, concordant with old records about the dead of our forgotten race. Wait, Rashawn has a... Rumored builders of the Speedball Network might know a way to bring it back online. Analysis of rails and ramps confirmed Speedball Network as a potential route into Skybase. Recommended action? Follow survey probe through Cerulean Expanse and investigate signal. Shot analysis long. At least we have a lead. Presence confirmed of ser servants to the queen that was. Confrontation likely unavoidable. Don't worry, they can fight. Probe calibrated. We'll keep beep faster to show objects of interest. Good luck. And we get a probe. Nice. The Cerulean Expanse. Could they really be somewhere in there and still alive somehow? One more thing, Cedric. Yes? I want them to see what we are facing. The Dweller of Dread? Show them. Dispatching drone. Oh, 
Oh, okay, yeah. It's like a Cthulhu monster under the o Yeah, no, that's gonna be fine. Your people were taking this thing down. Solstice warriors demonstrate emotional investment. Might negatively affect performance. Recommended action, breathe in. Don't worry about us. That monster is getting its due for Garl. Recommended action, breathe out. <laughs> Thanks, Cedric. Okay. First, the moon has to shine again. We need you two at full power. The Cerulean Expanse is east of Rapine. Here's hoping whatever we find there will be able to help. Teeks. You go ahead. I want to talk with Cedric. I'll catch up later. Huh. Fascinating. Okay. Probe calibrated. We'll beat faster. Good luck. Friends, what the heck? -a? Is there any? Was there something here we could? Decryption council online. Please present any data strips you may have. Decryption not possible unless more are found. Recommended. Find more data stri data strips. She say anything? Okay. Y'all, this is wild. I cannot believe. Not only are we in another world. Like, we knew something was going on with Sarai. We knew she was a robot. I kind of thought that maybe she was, like, advanced. Somehow an advanced thing from uh, the Clockwork Castle was kind of my thought. And that's why she, like, time didn't affect her is because she was a construct. Uh, but, nope, time didn't affect her because she is not from that timeline. She's from this one. So, that is amazing. We are going to the Cerulean Expanse to see if we can, I don't know, figure out how to defeat this giant Dweller of Dread that looks terrifying. It's like this giant Cthulhu-looking thing under the sea so that we can free the moon and be able to take this fight to... Uh, they said her name, El Elrendale... Uh, Arendale... No lo uh, let it go frozen stuff. I don't know. We also in the last episode, got every single fish that we could. So now we're heading to the Cerulean Expanse. We have a probe. Okay. Yeah, we're using this probe to see if we can find stuff. And there's like... Oh, it'll keep beeping to tell... Oh. What is that? Well, that's interesting. We got like wheat and stuff. So the probe will react when there's stuff n nearby that we want. Looks like there's a few different exits. Dig here. What is this? Oh, there's like a yeah bunch of different areas we can go to. Use another thing here. What do we find? Oh, those are enemies. Those are new enemies. Ronin Cowboys. Uh, Weak to sun damage. Well, let's see if they like my extra large spirit ball. Huh. I expected more damage from me. Well, let's moon a ring. Oh, yeah, deleted 2,600 XP. All right, those weren't bad. They died to a sun ball and a moon ring. I can, I can do that. It doesn't look like the probe is reacting to anything else anymore. Yeah, I don't see, it's not beeping. I think, friends, that, so there's this, but what is, can we, hmm. I bet you, because there's a bunch of different exits here. So I think we follow this one. What does this area remind me of? Oh, uh, I don't know. Viewers, what does this remind you of? All right, we have another area. Ah, oh, yeah, meat and bones. Oh, I bet you there's gonna be another. Okay, another spot, maybe an enemy. Nope. Okay, so that means we want to go to that exit, right? And 
looks like there's more spots we can find. Oop, another one here. Oh, a chest! Wire plate armor. All right, so we can actually, we can equip that now on our dear Valir. Any other... Okay, it doesn't look like it's reacting to anything. So we want to use these now to head this way. It kind of, it's like... Oh, what game is it where it tells you... There's like a little thing you find and that tells you where to go and there's like different... I'm sure it's used in a bunch of things, but... All right, so that one's... Another corner. Oh no, it's a lot of enemies. Okay, how do we want to deal with these? I think we... I think we sunball. Check out my extra large spirit bomb. And then, so this is gonna, oh, oh, oh. Oh, that, oh, it did like a little, oh, that was cool. All right, and then we're gonna swap to, I think we swap to her to use Venom Flurry. I don't think it matters though. Like, honestly, I think, yeah. Okay, that one's gonna hit us with a full panhandling. Oh, that is, that is amazing. It has, that's a game. You're so, you're, um, you're awesome. You're an awesome game. Four thousand experience, though. Holy smokies! All right, do we have another? I feel like there's been about three digs that we can do on every little area, but the probe doesn't seem to be showing up anything else here. So we want to use this exit here. Reacted to something. I feel like usually there's something in the middle here. Whoop. I'll take even more enemies. Oh, okay. Or potatoes. Hmm. Oh, there we go. Chest. Enemies. Oh, or the way we have to go. Chest or enemies. Chest! 25 gold. That does not seem... Okay, cool. Thank you. Appreciate that. All right, so we only have one way to go. It wants us to go directly north. Oh, that way. Oh, that looked like, is that stuff? No. We'll go this way then. Hmm. Unless it's saying that those are the areas. What if it's like actually the opposite? And those are the areas we don't want to go. You know? All right, we need to take down this drone. We don't want that thing to use its hex shield that it does, because that thing stinks, dude. Ow. All right, we're going to switch to Valir here. She's going to take a boost. 79. Yes. Okay, cool. Some sun damage. There we go. See ya. Ten more of those battles and we'll be hitting another level up here. All right. What do we find? Materials. Chest. Yes. This one has crustads. Oh, there's even more. Wait, how many? All right. That's our fourth one here. Oh, there's another one. This area is loaded with stuff to find. More enemies? Oof. Okay, this one kind of sucks, but we're gonna do dash strike. 20 minutes later. All right, there we go. That one took a little while. If a hex shield goes out, it just takes so long to defeat those. All right, so I guess we could just go this way then? What if it's actually the opposite way? I don't know. It's it's kind of... Oh, no! That's a lot of enemies. That is a lot of enemies. 
All right. How do we want to do this? Uh, we use his abeyance on this drone. So, I got to defeat that drone. So, we're going to do Sunball. Cool. Deleted. Unfortunately, this is going to be a big photon salvo, but... Still didn't do that much damage. And then I think she just moon rings and we'll be fine. We just win. Nice. 5,000 XP for that one. Heck yeah. All right, probe. Where are we going? Tell me where to go. What if we went the opposite way? You know what I mean? There's got to be more stuff to dig up here, right? Is it just the two spots? I think it's actually just the two spots. Well, okay. So we'll head down this way then. I mean, either there's just a lot of different ways to go, or... Wait! Hmm. Another dig here in the center. Ah! Oh, we can take these guys. Abeyance. Abeyance is so good. I should have known a lot of, uh... Garl's abilities were starting to feel redundant. That, you know, maybe Garl was going to have a hard time. There we go. How much XP? 4,000. Cruising. All right, we do need to use... Um, maybe we could use his there just to get some, uh, some HP back. Oh, we got another one. More enemies. Dude, damn it. I mean, I wasn't, I wasn't hoping for more enemies. That's not good. And defeated. I mean, they're all, they're, they can be hard, but they're not, you know, they're not too difficult. Oh, we got another one. All right, this is going to tell us where to go, I think. I hope. And looks like we're just going, oh, there's another one. Oh, another one here. I'm really glad it's not more enemies because I am hurting. All right, looks like we're going to go south here then. I, surely this is what it's supposed to do, right? Is you follow that to tell you where to go? But I almost wonder if it's if it's the opposite. You're supposed to go like in the opposite direction of where it tells you. Hmm. Uh, there might not be another one here. This is a really weird area comparatively to a lot of what we've done uh, before this. So if we go this way. Oh, there we go. Okay, so it, we did just have to, you know, just follow that along. Let's go this way then. Now we're heading here because Cedric said that the dead ones were here, right? There's no one. Another setback. Sarai. <clears throat> Cedric detected something here. We have to find it. The Lost Ones Hamlet. What is this mist? There's like different color. Ooh. Oh, that doesn't look good. Oh. Whoops. Ephraim built this place. Really? This used to be one of his workshops. And this dome design... Huh. We are in a container for souls. Aferul. Why? His experiments left a presence behind. One moment. A 
Attention all. This concoction will dispel the concealment curse. Those who wish to remain hidden, look away now. Whoa, what? Oh? It worked. Hey, I can see you. What color am I? What happened here? Another wicked experiment. I knew Averil was meddling with souls, but to detach living beings from their bodies. So he hides the proof and leaves them here to wander forever? Your friend is a coward. Mm, Averil's not... These people might know something that can help. Let's ask around. Oh, one ran away. I Sounds like maybe these are the ones that we heard about. Hmm. I don't know why I looked. Leave me alone. Okay, what about you? Need anything for the journey ahead? You're a merchant? Oh my gosh, look at you. You got pain, pain door and a gourmet burger. Yeah, we'll buy that. And then I need to sell some stuff so that I can buy... Also feeds the mind. Gives us 9 MP for the whole party. Hmm. Well, let's go ahead and buy... We gotta buy all of those. We need all the recipes. Thanks, little guy. There's some down here, too. The one who did experiments on us. He was not well. I'm guessing they are talking about Aferol, right? I saw someone darting towards the exit. Don't they know we're stuck here? No, you tell me first. Well, what color am I? Well, what does mine say? No, what does mine say? It's good to be able to see each other after all this time. This is a special day for sure. I do not miss the tank. They were in tanks. Bist was always a special one. Bist, Bist. Is that, I'm guessing that's the one that ran away? Is there anything else we can get here? any items or anything? This is so weird. What the hecka? It's locked. Okay. Maybe... You're solstice warriors, aren't you? How do you know? The dead of a forgotten race know many things. Hey, that was... We heard about them. Being the dead of a of a forgotten race. Something would teach him about living glass. Who are you? I am called Bist. Do you know anything about Sky Base? Yes, my people remember when the place was built, back when we had physical forms. Unfortunately, the access route went offline after Sky Base was corrupted to create the clouds. Corrupted? Yes. It was the first step in the build-up to our world's downfall. You mean Skybase wasn't always designed for nefarious deeds? Oh no, it used to regulate climate and keep our planet lush. It was beautiful. The evil machine that took over Skybase eventually corrupted its AI core, the creator of the cyborgs. It called itself the Catalyst. So that's where I'll find the bastard. You remember? We thought it erased memories, too. We only remember its name. Sarai. I'm okay. Just one more reason to get to Skybase. The speedball network is the only way. Do you know how we could restore power? Yes. When it became clear that our world would fall, we built a failsafe. Oh, what is that? Admits the sacrosanct spires it hides in plain sight. A titan made of cybernetics and stone, holding a giant block up high. If the brakes are released, it will drop the block, returning the energy that was spent to lift it up. The most primitive form of battery, holding just enough power to support our world's last-ditch effort. We named it Estraste. But the entrance to the Sacrosanct Spires is sealed. My people tried everything. That seal is an easy one to break for those who know how. 
so you can get us in? Absolutely, provided you can find a way to take me there. What do you mean? This one understands. Hmm. Bist and his people are stuck here. This dome is the only thing preventing them from dissipating into nothingness. As I said, I will help, but you first need to get me there. Hmm. And I also wish to fight by their side. Tell me, how good of an alchemist are you? I dabble. Can you do it? Living glass. One final attempt, perhaps. Are you sure you understand what you are demanding? Yes, for a way to fight back and help reclaim my world. The procedure cannot be undone. I understand. I would need proper tools, but my code prevents me from breaking into Aferol's workshop. If you can get the door open, I will do it. You're not dodging this one. Oh, Sarai! Cedric, I'm uploading a 3D scan. Transmission received. Lock level. Intricate. Can you make the key? Affirmative. Good. I'm sending the probe to pick it up. Oh, bye probe! And now we wait. This is... I am... What is happening? But your life... I guess I just never imagined such a long stretch of time. If my understanding is correct, you and Valir are on such a path yourselves. I... One day at a time, and I have much to learn about combat myself. I believe we can teach one another. Still, I bet Garl would have managed to make them laugh. <laughs> yeah, I bet. I'm sorry, Valir. I didn't mean... Oh, no, it's okay. See, I used to think grief was a negative emotion that eventually went away, but it doesn't work like that. It's just always there. So, it's not like there's anything you could say that would suddenly make me remember him. Sometimes I feel really sad, and other times I find myself smiling and thinking of fond memories. It's like Zale said, he's always with us on some level. I think I'm slowly starting to understand that it just means I'm lucky to have had someone so dear to me. Does that make sense? It does. Thank you, Valir. This helps me, too. Just like Garl to be the highlight of the day without even being here. <laughs> I miss Garl so much! Looks like our key just arrived. Ready? I should warn you, the abomination that tortured us still inhabits the place. We'll take care of it. Yeah, we will. Poor little soul. Surely you won't try to enter the workshop. You know there's something big and dangerous in there, right? Uh, yeah, and I can take it. I can, I can fisticuffs it all day. Did these change anything? So, oh no. What's his name? Psst. <laughs> I listen. This looks so cool. Oh my gosh. We got a wall. Oh, hey, bud. Listen, Rashan, I got you something. A rare find in Sarai's world. A walnut cork. Plus seven magic attack. Plus three attack. We're getting up there. We're getting up there. Hopefully we find some weapon upgrades. Oh. What kinds of experiments were going on here? We're ending this. Can we, like, break it? Oh, I saw something twinkling over there. I see a chest or anything. Man, it's, like, a little somber. 
Like, the music's a little, you know, like the... I guess it should be. This pod. This is where I was kept all those years. And this one. Core. At long last, you will be avenged. The monster is up ahead. Make sure you are prepared. Are, are we prepared? Yeah, we're prepared. It looks like they... Oh, we can talk to this. The monster. Okay. So you're staying here? Oh, they have... They literally gave us a save point and stuff right here. All right. Well, let's use this. Let's set up a camp first. Let's continue on. And hopefully defeat the abomination that did this to Bist and the long, the dead of the forgotten race? Let's do it. What the? This, this is the operator. Seems pretty dead to me. Be careful, Zale. Machines can be deceiving. It's moving. Get ready. What the hecka? Oh my god, it's like on a crane arm. Are you serious? Holy. Look at that. Look at that butt chin. This thing can blow its nose and wipe its ass at the same time. All right. So why don't we... It looks like that's the only one that... The only thing that's targetable. It can't hit any of the arms around it. Ah, I'm thinking we get a big sunball to the face then. Oh, oh my gosh. Whoa, that is so cool. Oh. Wait a, wait a minute though. So there's a red canister, green canister. It got a scar after we hit it. That is amazing. I think we need to, I mean, we're not gonna be able to break both of these. Let's hit this one. And we'll use, I'm a little worried about, we'll use Sarai. All right, there we go. We broke one canister. We're not gonna be able to break that one. Oh my God, that did, how much damage? Are you serious? Okay. Uh. Use healing light for sure. And then we'll have... I love the animation on this thing when it gets hit. Oh, oh, okay, so it's more. Uh, I don't know. We're not gonna be able to break this one. I can't switch. All right, so I think we just attack this one again, the green. Wow, why are you always hitting Zale? What did Zale do to you? All right, and then Valir. Cool, broke that. All right, we have a combo of two now. How much boost? Three boost. All right, let's do it. Big sunball. Sunball just does so much damage. 180, so, oh yeah, look at that thing. Oh, I love that you can actually see the damage that it does. That is so cool. Arcane Barrage also delays its turn. I mean, do we use it? We got two, or maybe we just wait for Moonshiv actually. Why don't we do that? So we can disorient it. Oh, that is so cool. All right, we get a free, a free item, or it's not a free item, but it doesn't take our turn. So then we can sunball again. Oh, oh that is so cool. Its face gets forked up, dude. All right, let's moon ring. We're filling up that combo so that we can get an ultimate. 172 damage. 
Oh, uh oh, oh no, that's a lot of them. Oh shit. How much health do they all have? We have no idea. What? Um, I can do X strike. You know what? Yeah. Okay. Blocked a lot of that. All right, we're going to do Welsh. Oh my God, it's face. Uh, I can't do, if I do dash strike, looks like you actually have to block it to be able to. If I attack this. Okay. I think what we do here is we actually hit this I don't know. I'm going to kind of feel like green's going to heal. You know what I mean? Let's find out. It it does. Okay. Only 39, though. That's not that big of a deal. So I think we take a boost here, and then we combo Solstice Strike on the face. Nice. Okay. This is this is great though because we can now we can swap to Rashawn who can use his ultimate hitting all of these. I I know I want to use Valir's ultimate. I think we'll be able to. We'll we'll definitely get her. We'll we'll get her ultimate. Yeah, that is great because now we can do I can do dash strike on everything. Which broke those. And then she can hit this purple one. I feel like that one had the biggest locks, so potentially would have done the most damage. Oh my god, you're already doing more, though. We gotta finish this. Arcane Moons. Oof. All right, another blue. And let's do... That green's gonna hit. I don't think there's anything we can do here. We can use... I think we take this and we Moonerang the face and hope that it's enough damage. Oof. Not enough damage. Alright, so that's gonna be a full heal. Well, not a full heal, but... Oh, 59 damage. That's nothing. Alright, we can do a combo solstice strike. 112 damage. Alright, more things coming out here. We gotta break that purple one. For sure. Oh, there's two purple. All right, you know what? We're going to swap to Sarai. Sarai is going to... Oof, this is tough. Venom Flurry. 66 damage. Oh, my gosh. Solstice Strike. I mean, do we think it's almost dead? I'm worried about the two purple ones, to be honest with you. But Solstice Strike might be enough to beat it. I don't know. Let's... Ah, uh, do I risk it for the biscuit? Ah, uh, I don't know. I think I think we just attack this. Attack that one. And then... Whoo! And then she can attack this. Alright. Now we have to deal with... This purple? Oh, jeez. Holy sh... That is a lot of damage. Uh, we... Alright, we got a moon ring. Uh, mending light here. 
We're so close to getting another ultimate. 120. All right, it's going to take two heals. So for 60, 60 health each. Yeah, that's not good. I think we use... We use Valir's ultimate here. Uh, we haven't seen it yet, so let's hope for the best. Luana's Might Retribution. Seeing it for the first time, y'all. Oh, and there we go. Chin up. Goodbye, Meduso. And that's a level up. We don't have magic attack or MP, so I guess we're just gonna go with health. And Sarai. Oh, uh, what? I am confused. I guess we'll just take a magic attack here? Rashan, what are you gonna do? Magic attack for sure. Now he's at 104 magic attack. Valir is going to take, uh, jeez. I guess we'll go with magic attack. Ugh, everyone's better off without that thing. Sean, did you know? This world is unknown to me. I wish I could say the same of Ephraim's ways. The workbench is just ahead. We should hurry. Okay, this thing, get out of here. That fight was crazy. Maybe I should have bought those weapons earlier. That was a tough fight, actually. That was probably the toughest so far. Yes, this will do. Living glass will only materialize for a soul that carries unwavering determination. One last time. Are you absolutely sure that this is what you want? I am. Then follow me. So, you will do this for me? Of course. But how will I know when it is time? Just follow their lead. And remember, only the three of you can enter the portal. I understand. What does that mean? So, so the three of us, so obviously Valir, Zale, and... Psst. It worked. Oh my, what? What is the, what? I can feel. Glass is a very fragile material. I bound its living properties to your mind. You must always have purpose, for this vessel is only as resistant as your will is strong. Then I am invincible. Thank you for giving me physical form again, great alchemist. For centuries, I have longed for the chance to reclaim my world. To the sacrosanct spires, then? Are you sure you can get us in? Definitely. The crazed cultist won't take kindly to trespassers, but I am eager to test my new form. We'll deal with whatever comes our way. I look forward to fighting by your side. The spires are in the northwest corner. Let's hurry. Psst, joins the party? I'm sorry, excuse me? To the teeth. Unlock all combos. <sighs> oh, wait. This means Garl's actually gone? Like, gone, go I was, I've been hoping, no way. Oh, he can't change his weapon, though. His stats, oh, he's just a tank, dude. Chipped Glass Fist, Dual Simulcrum. Living Glass Golem is, his, is what he is. I, like, kind of want to give him that. Increases bonus. Yeah, we'll just grab that. And I mean, do you literally, do you really need anything else? Grab that and cornucopia. 
That is, he is, that is awesome. Moderate blunt and arcane damage to a single, oh, right, because we lost like another blunt damage. I guess he's gonna be our blunt. Inspires the target, curing KO'd state and healing slightly. Arcane damage to a single target can be timed for bonus AOE damage. And then he also has an ultimate, or they have an ultimate attack. All right, so they do arcane and blunt. Wow. I saw something sparkling back here. There we go. That is so cool. I guess that's it here then. Let's go, dude. Let's go. How are we on health? Yeah, we're going to rest real quick cuz you I listen, I don't know. And of course, I definitely want to check through the spires then. We can do this. The Sacrosanct spires are in the northwest corner. Let's hurry. And looking at the tube here, I have never been to this world, but the magic in here feels familiar. Living glass. The crone was right. That's true, Yamara said it. I am eager to test my new form. All right, cool. That is so dope. Does he, I wonder if psst, we'll say anything. This is where, okay. I guess we're leaving then. Like we've done, I think we've done everything we can here. We are Audi. Let's go. I love the music in here. The music when psst, was being created too was wildly cool. All right, let's see. Do they say anything? Still can't believe we're finally rid of the canister monster. You're pretty strong. It's true. Our probe is still over there. Our drone probe. Hmm. I don't know why I look. Oh, okay. That guy's still saying the same stuff. I'd never want living glass for myself, but I'm happy for psst. Why wouldn't you want it for yourself? It seems pretty cool. Living glass, huh? Do not miss the tank. Be good to see each other after all this time. This is a special day for sure. Nice. Psst, was always a special one. Psst. All right. We're outside now of... We're still in the Cerulean Expanse, so this is the Lost One's Hamlet. How do we, can we get back to, I'm assuming we can get back to the thing we were on, right? Okay, so if we just come here, we can go back to the Cerulean Expanse. And it looks like that's it that we can do here, but we have to go back to, I guess we don't have to go to Rapine. We need to go to, back through the Derelict Factory, and then, right, there's no other way through. And then we can use the Vespertine to go to the Sancrosanct Spires. Man, this is a whole section of the game has been so cool. I'm so surprised. Like, look at we have another party member. I, if you, I would not have, I never in a million years would have thought that they were giving us, like, I kind of thought that Garl was going to come back. I, I don't think it's hit me yet that, that, that means Garl officially is not coming back. You know? Anyways, the area that we now need to go, there's a wheels champion left, is Sancrosanct Spires. That's where we got to head to right now. Well, there's literally nothing on the, there's nothing there. So why don't we head to where, well, there's this too. I, I feel like we'll be speedball network. Well, yeah, we're going to head there soon, I'm sure. So why don't we go? This is where we have to go. Right here. There's nothing on the boat, but it took me a little while to find bzzzt. Anyways, we can find ourselves on Synchrosanct Spires, which is the name of this island. And I guess we'll be tackling that in the next episode of Sea of Stars. Thank you so much for watching. Remember to like, comment, subscribe. It really helps out the series. But friends, I think we're cruising to the end. Thank you for watching. And remember, never give up, never surrender to Meduso. Yeah.